ports, exam halls, and ports as the cost of living bites industrial action leads. The health service in crisis, say the unions, with more than 47,000 unfilled NHS nursing roles across the UK and thousands more leaving, they say, because of being burned out and underpaid. And what the Tory government is doing now is moving against the trade union so that we are no longer able to take effective strike action going forward. And they think that will close down the protest, close down dissent and allow them to impose these changes and these cuts that we're going to see in the budget in a couple of weeks' time. So it's a really important uh, turning point, I think, in our country where we've got to show that we're not going to accept uh, these infringements of human rights and, and uh, infringements on the right to strike. without anything to eat, drink, we're struggling to finish on time. It, it's, it's absolutely horrendous. Enough is enough. We want to protect our patients. We want to make a difference. We want to do our jobs properly. The only way now is to take that action, and trust me, nobody wants to do it. <laughs> 